Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to another video. So today we are back in Liberty County and I will be doing an updated version of how to do a donut in the uh, ERLC. So I've been out of video ideas recently and uh, this is one of my most popular non-cinematic videos and like a video that I can do any time of the year. So yeah, and the last version was 7 months ago, so yeah, anyways, let's get on with it. So to start doing the donuts, you want to press T on your keyboard, that will activate the traction control or TCS. And then you also want to press Y on your keyboard, that will activate the ABS which is a grip setting. And then basically if you press N, you, uh, it turns on semi mode, which you can use to like limit your speed so like if you're driving in a roleplay server. Or you could also use it to drive manually, so currently I'm holding W and my car is reversing. So anyways, you want to bring this up to third gear. So it should say 3, like over here, and it should be in semi mode. Then you want to also have a sports car for this. It won't work in a normal Honda Civic or a Toyota Corolla. It needs to be in a sports car. If you don't know what vehicles are sports cars and what are not, I just recommend mainly going for a good looking expensive car which will most likely be a sports car. This is for example the Bullhorn the Terminator, it's only $80,000 and it's a sports car. And then what you want to do is hold shift and start spinning in circles. So you won't immediately start doing perfect donuts, but you will start doing donuts soon. So let's just keep on driving until we can do some donuts. Okay, so we just started drifting, and I also recommend doing this in an open space like the civilian's farm or the farm's area where there is not a lot of like buildings and stuff. So I also do not recommend doing it in like an area with trees or uneven ground like this terrain. You should do it on a road. Uh, so yeah, let's get back to the road, and we can continue on doing these donuts. And soon if you keep on doing donuts without like bumping into a car or a tree or a light pole, then you can actually start doing like perfect full circles. So you just have to trust the process and give it a moment. You also need patience for this. So as you can see, our circles are becoming much more rounder and soon it's going to become perfect. So as you can see, now the trail is a perfect circle and it's not overlapping or anything. And I'm currently spinning in the same spot. And you also want to hold A or D depending on which direction you want to spin. So that was, I was holding D to spin right. And if you want to spin left, so then just hold A. It's the same process except you hold a different key. But anyway, so that's all there is to this simple tutorial. I hope this video helps. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.